Hey guys and welcome to another tutorial. In this one I'm going to show you how to make your glass material transparent and then we're going to improve our asteroid collision to be a lot more efficient. So to start, as you can see, our cockpit is now fully visible. So to do this, you need to go into your glass material and you're going to get rid of what we had there, the uh, four, <clears throat> and you're going to click hold three and click. And I'm not going to do it right now because it lags the video if I uh, do this. But hold 3 and click, uh, create your 3 vector and give it a value of 0 0.1, 0 0.1, 0 0.1. Then hold 1 and click, and give your constant a value of 0 0.2, and connect that to your opacity. And then once that's done, you'll have a nice clear cockpit. So the next thing we're going to do is we're going to change the asteroid collision. So go to our blueprints, weapons, ship projectile. Now, right now, what we're doing is we're spawning a target point on every transform for every instance to get the target point's location. Um, this We don't need to actually do this, we're going to do this by math. So get rid of the spawn target point actor and the get distance too. Get rid of those. And off the get instance transform, we're going to do break transform. And then off the location, we're going to do location minus, or vector minus vector. And we're going to subtract our hit location from our event hit. And then off that, we're going to do vector length. And then we're going to connect that to our less than. And we're going to connect that to our set distance to asteroid. And we'll also delete our lifespan since we no longer have target points. Then simply connect our branch to our for loop loop body. Compile and save. Now to clarify what we're doing here, is for every instance, we're getting its location and we're subtracting its location from the hit location and we're getting the vector length and then we're finding out what the shortest one is to find the nearest as instanced asteroid that we hit. Okay, so just to make sure this works, we'll go in and play, fly around to an asteroid and shoot it and it explodes. All right, so that's much more efficient. 